the perspective BRP Antonio Luna, FF-151, the country's second missile frigate ordered from Hyundai Heavy Industries, HHI, has successfully passed its sea acceptance trials, SAT, off Ulsan, South Korea from December 14 to 18. In a media statement late Friday, Rear Admiral Alberto Carlos, head of the Philippine Navy, PNS Technical Inspection and Acceptance Committee, TIAC, declared that FF-151 is compliant with the agreed technical specifications after personally witnessing the warship's performance during the sea trials. FF-151 is 95% complete at this time. All machinery and combat systems were subjected to test procedures as stipulated in the contract and were observed to be working properly. More importantly, I'm happy to announce that FF-151 passed the prescribed standards and procedures," he said. Carlo said upon completion of this week's SAT, BRP Antonio Luna's completion rating is almost 100%. This, he added, will pave way for the frigate redocking and final outfitting before delivery early next year. Built by South Korean shipbuilder HHI, BRP Antonio Luna is a modern naval warship capable of surface, subsurface, air, and electronic warfare using state-of-the-art electronic sensors, long-range missiles, acoustic-guided torpedoes, and an embarked anti-submarine helicopter. The ship is expected to be delivered and turned over to the PN in February next year. The first frigate, BRP Jose Rizal, FF-150, was delivered and subsequently commissioned into the Philippine Navy last July 10 this year. BRP Antonio Luna's key Elaine on May 23, 2019, coincided with the launch of BRP Jose Rizal, FF-150. The contract for the BRP Jose Rizal and the BRP Antonio Luna was placed at 16 billion pesos with another 2 billion pesos for weapon systems and munitions.